first time kong marinig ang Kaiser International Health Group. Hindi ko ito naririnig sa radyo or na, napabalitaan sa TV, sa mga advertisement. So, sino ba talaga si Kaiser International Health Group? Kaiser International Health Group is a registered company with Securities and Exchange Commission as a health care provider as approved by the Department of Health Bureau of Health Facilities. On top of the traditional HMO, HMO means Health Maintenance Organization, that provides healthcare benefits during employment years, Kaiser provides the second layer of HMO coverage for long-term or retirement needs. So, Kaiser programs consist of short-term, including corporate, individual, and family needs. Senior care programs, HMO for ages 60 and up, and long-term health care programs. Legit ba na HMO si Kaiser International Health Group? Yes, legit po si Kaiser International Health Group. Sa katunayan, Kaiser International Health Group is accredited by the Insurance Commission as an HMO or Health Maintenance Organization. And last February 2017, the Insurance Commission of the Philippines called all executives of HMO and created an umbrella group called PAMOC or Philippine Association of Health Maintenance Organization Companies. The president of Kaiser Health Group, Dr. Lea Uy Yolo, was also the vice chairman of the said organization. It was praised by the president Duterte itself as it will contribute the government mission for a reliable healthcare system for all Filipinos. Bakit ako maniniwala kay Kaiser, eh hindi naman ito na-endorse ng mga artista or other personalities na kikita sa TV. Sino-sino ba ang mga kliyente ng Kaiser International Health Group? Among many other customers, individuals, corporate clients, the House of Representatives and Staff, ibig sabihin yung mga congressmen, enjoy healthcare by Kaiser International. So for how many years, Kaiser International Health Group is the designated healthcare provider for the employees of our Philippine Congress. And recently, Ang Kaiser is the healthcare provider na rin for Department of Agrarian Reform or DAR. So isa lang patunay na talaga namang legit, di ba, ang Kaiser International Health Group kasi naman for how many years ito na ang healthcare provider ng ating government officials, ang House of Representatives and now yung bago nga is yung Department of Agrarian and Reform. How secure and financially stable is Kaiser International Health Group? The healthcare industry is a highly regulated industry. Before any company can be licensed, it has to fully comply with all the government requirements to make sure it is fully secured and can deliver its benefits to its clients. It is regularly monitored by the regulatory government agencies. Our Kaiser health care plans are designed by a licensed actuary not only to ensure compliance with established government regulations, but also to make sure that our products are financially sound and stable. Kaiser is one of the top most healthcare company in the healthcare industry in terms of capitalization and market share. Paano ko malalaman na secured ang aking investment sa Kaiser International Health Group? To ensure sustainability and security of all Kaiser long-term care plan holders' contributions, its funds are invested in a long-term investment vehicle. Kaiser International Health Group owns 80% of the youngest mutual fund company in the Philippines financial market, which is Soldibo Funds. 
Soldivo Funds was able to grow their assets to more than 200% in 2015, one year after it was launched. What is the financial viability of Kaiser International Health Group? As mentioned, Kaiser International Health Group is, a, is registered with SEC and has an authorized capitalization of 160 million pesos. It has fully complied with all the SEC regulations. It is also approved by the Department of Health to operate as an HMO. The investment and funds are managed by the top leading financial institutions in the industry. Magkano ba ang minimum na pwedeng kuhanin sa Kaiser Long-Term Healthcare Plan at magkano ang babayaran? Depende sa age mo at kung anong plan ang kukuhanin mo. So here's the minimum plans based sa age bracket. So starting age 10 to 40, ang minimum na plan na pwedeng kuhanin is K45. Ang monthly payment nito is 2,647. For ages 41 to 50, minimum plan of K60, a monthly payment of 3,529. And for ages 51 to 60, minimum plan of K75, monthly payment 4,412 pesos. So, kung mapapansin mo, the older you are, the higher the price of healthcare plans. Kaya nga, palaging sinasabi, it is better to start early. Kasi, ang price is mura pa. I have just bought a Kaiser 45 Ultimate Plan and... I would want to have a bigger coverage. Can I upgrade or buy another plan? Yes, a plan holder or member may upgrade his plan within 30 days from the member's effectivity date. The member may buy another plan only upon full payment of his policy. I have just bought a Kaiser 100 plan 100, or K100. Can I now avail of the annual physical and dental examination? The member can avail of these two outpatient benefits after paying full the first year's premium. So for example, if your mode of payment mo is annual, then you can avail immediately after receiving your online policy containing your benefit and dental card, provider directory, guidebook, and your schedule of benefits with the contract provisions. I have a Kaiser K55 plan which I'd like to transfer to my daughter kasi I'm migrating to the US. How do I go about transferring it? The member shall be required to sign an amendment form and the daughter signs a new application for membership form and submit it to IMG office or sa Kaiser office located sa King's Court building Shinoroses Avenue sa Makati City. Do I need to use Kaiser's network of providers? Yes, you must stay within the network at least during the accumulation or paying period. However, after the accumulation period, you can avail of your medical needs using your own set of providers and then file for reimbursement within your allowable health benefit. So, sino-sino ba yung mga partner hospitals, clinics na accredited by Kaiser International? Kindly see the accredited list of hospitals and clinics sa Kaiser website. If a member dies, is his K100 plan transferable to any of his beneficiaries? And how much will his beneficiary get? If the plan has approved term insurance coverage, the plan is transferable to the primary beneficiary. 
Kaiser shall pay the principal amount of the term insurance equivalent to the member's long-term care benefit of 100,000 pesos kasi ang plan is K100, so 100,000 pesos plus 85% of the total premium if no claims were made during the accumulation or payment period. If the cost of death is an accident, then the amount will be doubled. Bakit ko kailangan kumuha ng Kaiser Long-Term Health Care Plan kung kami ng mga anak ko ay covered na sa health care plan benefit ng asawa ko sa company niya? Kailangan mo pa rin kumuha. Kahit yung husband mo, kailangan pa rin niyang kumuha ng individual healthcare plan outside sa company kasi yung benefit na meron kayo ngayon ng family mo doon sa company na kung saan nagtatrabaho ang iyong asawa ay may limitation lang. So, ibig sabihin, if yung asawa mo ay hindi na connected sa company na pinagtatrabahoan niya ngayon, mapuputol na rin ang medical or healthcare benefits na meron kayo sa company ng asawa mo. So, wais na move talaga kung meron kayong individual healthcare plan aside dun sa healthcare benefits na meron kayo dun sa company ng asawa mo. Bakit sinasabing 3-in-1 product si Kaiser Long-Term Healthcare? Kasi if you apply for Kaiser Long-Term Healthcare, para kang nag-open ng iyong time deposit. Meron kang savings, of course, investment. At at the same time, meron ka ng healthcare at insurance coverage. Kaya siya tinatawag na 3-in-1 product. Pwede ba akong mag-apply or kumuha ng Kaiser Long-Term Healthcare kahit nasa abroad ako? Yes, you can apply Kaiser Long-Term Healthcare online. So those are the frequently asked questions about Kaiser International Health Group. So